Save the animals. That is the rally cry of college students now fighting to protect a farm located on their campus. Pace University planning to shut it down due to the financial crisis brought on by the pandemic. Here's News 4's Adam Cooperstein. They have pigs, goats, even raptors. The Pace University Nature Center in Pleasantville is a rare attraction to have on a college campus. I had gone to pay specifically for the Nature Center. The school's website calls the animals here charismatic ambassadors, providing students with irreplicable opportunities. But students who work there just got word that Pace is planning to remove the Nature Center because of pandemic-induced cost-cutting. My initial reaction was pure shock, pure sadness. Um, I cried. Pace tells us it was a difficult decision, and the animals will be missed. But the Nature Center will now be converted into a laboratory with plants only. They say this better supports our academic programs, provides the strongest options for programming based on student interest and career opportunities, will save on costs, and is similar to farms at other colleges. We are committed to the safety and well-being of our animals, and they will be placed in new homes with other organizations in the region by the end of the year. We want to create a dialogue with the university about how can we provide uh, an alternative Students say they'll do whatever it takes to keep at least some animals on campus. They've created a petition and a fundraiser, hoping to cover the cost of feeding the animals. Supplement food. We can get donations. There are lots of um, environmental organizations that can help. So many people are expressing their interest in the center and the animals. And I really do think we believe we have a good shot because I know Pace really does love listening to their students. Pace hasn't responded to the student's proposal and is yet to give an exact date for the changes to their nature center. Adam Cooperstein, News 4 New York. Hope those students can find a solution soon. In the meantime, we're expecting more storms in the forecast, but Dave, you have